what is going on and I'm here to provide you all a tip on LinkedIn this is incredibly important people have been asking me this over and over and over again on how to do LinkedIn voice messages I believe LinkedIn voice messages is something that we should all pay attention to because it's one of the best things you can do to penetrate into net new accounts I've had people schedule meetings with CTOs VPs of sales, CROs, CEOs, IT security, APAC, EMEA. The reason I'm saying all those things is because it doesn't matter. People are responding to these messages. And I'm going to give you all the formula of how to go about this. So first and foremost, when you go do a LinkedIn voice message, you have to be first degree connected with your prospects. This also is a great way to re-engage with prospects who've gone ghost on you. So once you have now understood how to go about this, you can also do this on the mobile, right? You can only do this on the mobile device, on LinkedIn mobile, right? Some of you guys may be like, oh, I'm gonna do my computer. Sorry, only LinkedIn mobile. Now, let's talk about the formula to do this. First and foremost, in your first 10 seconds, you wanna come with some type of insight or trigger that you have found. Now, how you go about that, that could be on their LinkedIn profile, on their website, something they posted on LinkedIn, YouTube, et cetera, but you're using this insight and trigger to reach out to them, right? Because that's gonna get someone's attention. If you don't get someone's attention the first five to 10 seconds, they will not pay attention to you. So this is incredibly important. Next thing is the next 30 seconds. Okay, so the next 30 seconds is focused on the value prop or an elevator pitch. Or think about it, whatever you're saying on the phone, that 30 seconds is that next bit there. You all know what that is because you say it on the phone, you're making cold calls, insert it there. Next is the last 10 seconds, which is the call to action. What do you want them to do? If you're going to an event, hey, say, hey, come by the booth. If you're going to be in the city, hey, I'd like to come to your office and meet with you. If you want to schedule a meeting, schedule for 30 minutes. Right, the, your call to action is up to you, but you want to make sure that you're stating what you want out of this voice message. My additional tip here: once you have done that voice message, it'll be around 45 to 55 seconds. You can only cap it up to 60 seconds, so you guys know that. Make sure two days later you follow up with asking this question. This will get you more responses. Let's say if I'm reaching out to Scott. Hi, Scott. Any feedback on my voice message? That will help you get more responses, and get more meetings. So hopefully you all can take that insight and go execute and get yourself some meetings. Keep dialing, y'all.